University of Maine has made history by constructing the first 3D printed home made entirely of recyclable materials. With the use of wood waste from sawmills and bioresins, the university was able to print the floors, walls, and the ceiling. The house comes in pieces, ready to be fit together with the doors, windows, and electrical wiring that are already built in. Several key figures who helped make this project happen were at today's unveiling ceremony that includes Senator Susan Collins and Governor Janet Mills. The engineers behind the project hope the 600-foot house is the first step to a larger project. It's aimed to combat labor shortages and a lack of affordable housing in Maine. Right now there's a need for 20,000 low-income homes in the state of Maine. And for a one-bedroom low-income home, uh, it costs close to $300,000 right now, uh, and uh, if, if you can get one. So the problem is there's a lot of people who can't come to Maine, uh, who can't come and work in Maine or live in Maine because they can't find homes. Uh, so what we hope to do is, is uh, help solve this problem. Uh, it's not, we're not going to 3D print every home, of course, in Maine, but certainly will be part of the housing stock. According to the University of Maine, mass production and factories of the 3D printed bio-based homes still years away, but they say the first step has been made.